we shouldn't be surprised the new BMW M5 is extremely heavy that doesn't make it any less disappointing, though. When the new BMW M5 debuted last week, its immense output from the plug-in hybrid V8 was overshadowed by the car's hefty curb weight. At 5,390 pounds, the seventh generation of the super sedan is a little over 1,000 pounds heavier than its predecessor. No doubt, that's a massive difference, but it was to be expected. Allow us to explain. First of all, the M5 G90 is much larger than its predecessor. At 200.6 inches long, 77.6 inches wide, and 59.4 inches tall, the speedy Luxobarge is 4.2 inches longer, 2.7 inches wider, and 1.6 inches taller than the F90 model before it. Concomitantly, it's also slightly bigger than the regular 5 series upon which it's based. It's the first M5 to have wider tracks than the lesser Fiver. In addition, its wheelbase is longer to accommodate a different suspension geometry. That brings us to another sign we had all along about the new M5 putting on weight. The 550e xDrive is also a plug-in hybrid with AWD but with a smaller inline-six engine instead. Curious to know how much that weighs. It tips the scales at 4,751 pounds in European specification. The US spec 550e's curb weight has not been disclosed yet, but it can't be significantly different. At the heart of the partially electrified 550e xDrive is a B58 engine with a 3.0-litre displacement and a single turbocharger. The S68 that goes inside the new M5 is a significantly larger 4.4-litre unit with an extra turbo. Shoving a much bigger engine underneath the hood partially explains the weight penalty between the M5 and the 550e. Their batteries are almost the same capacity, 18.6 kWh for the former and 19.4 kWh for the latter. We're not trying to play the devil's advocate here but that 5,390 pound curb weight largely was predictable. There's no denying that it's unusual for a car with a combustion engine to be heavier than its fully electric counterpart. We are talking about the i5 M60, a dual motor EV that weighs 5,247 pounds. Yes, the new M5 is 143 pounds heavier than the electric M performance model. That's despite the fact the i5 M60 has a much larger battery pack, at 81.2 kWh vs just 18.6 kWh for the M5. Weight distribution is also important since it impacts the fun factor. BMW quotes 50.1% front and 49.9% rear for the hot EV. As for the M5, it's an almost perfect 50 colon 50, but we are certain the car is more nose heavy due to its big V8. If weight is a concern, it's about to get worse. The new M5 Touring is coming soon, and it'll be even heavier since wagons tend to be slightly fatter than the sedans upon which they are based. That said, what's another few more pounds when the car already weighs well over 5,000 pounds? The silver lining here is that BMW is bringing the G99 to America.